Hey YouTube, um, by the way, yes, I do have a new intro. Um, no, I'm not totally copying Race Day 2011 in that I did to do one right now because I changed my YouTube name, so I have an excuse, na 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 na. Anyway, as you saw by the title below, because YouTube has to change everything, this is my second annual NASCAR Diecast Review Contest. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um... Yes, I'm a little late on this because if you saw the last, or if you remember, last one started June 14th and ended June 17th. Or I, I posted the results that day, so I don't remember which day I closed it. Uh, so, um, yes. If you do also remember from last year, there was no, not as many um, rules. But there will be a lot more this year. And um, why am I pointing the camera out that way? Is because I'm going to have to show you a few things to explain the rules. So don't think I'm lazy and uh, I have a bad hair day or something. So let me get to the rules. Rules. It must be a 2013 car. Exceptions. If it's a 2012 car that came out in 2013 so let me recall which cars that would include that would include the Kozlowski uh, retro and championship car but include the Jeff Gordon Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles car and the Ryan Newman Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles car and that would also include the Dale Jr. Um, what, the, to paint the 88 car that, I think that's it. If there are any more, please tell me. Um, but um, it doesn't matter what what scale they are. And again, these these will be in the description, so you can read these as I as I say them. Uh, it, I don't care what scale it is. Um, it doesn't have to be. It can be a custom too. Uh, so if you have like a custom car and you want to review that for the contest, that's fine. Um, uh, again, same. Same as last year, you don't put a can in front of there and say you're sponsored. Um, so, hey YouTube, this will be a new diecast review on Dale Earnhardt Jr.'s Diet Mountain Dew 2013 Chevrolet. Uh, this is a pretty cool car. Let's do a 360 view. And I'll go ahead and take it out. This review is sponsored by Monster Energy. And yeah. No, no. Do not do that. Um, another thing is, um, like l last year, I said you have to start out with the car in the box. Um, I'm going to keep that. Start out with the car in the box. Please do that. Unless it's a 124, if it's a 124, just show the box, like last year. Um, I don't know why I picked the Dale Jr. car, but... Anyway, so when you get to the car, uh, there's basically no rules uh, for when you get to the car. Um, shocking, I know. Um, the only thing I require for when the car is out of the box is at least a one 360 view of the car without it hand interference. So you go like that, like that, like that, and I... To explain, I have no idea where that came from. Uh, when I bought the car, that's how it came. So, or not? No, not no hand to hand interference. Just give, just give me a 360 view so I can see all the sides of the car. And this year, what I'm, and then I'll tell you the grading scale of how this is gonna work. And it's not exactly like what I'm gonna be grading on is um and these are also these also depend on what you do so like i assume everyone's gonna at least look at the main or like some of the sponsors um how well you do that like if you stumble a bunch of on a ton of words then i'm gonna t i'm probably gonna take away from that um it, when you do the paint scheme if you explain every single little piece of the paint scheme and i've done this before too um but i'm not i'm gonna count off for that and um 
because that just gets annoying. Really, usually, like, you can really do the paint scheme like this. And it's a white splitter, and then this green comes up, and it comes to the back. And then it stops at the deck lid. That's basically all you have to do for the paint scheme. Honestly. That's all you have to do for the paint scheme. Um, and the, the, we can see. And I, I've been I've done that before too, so I'm trying to stop that. So, and I know some people don't do the paint scheme, so that's kind of why um, I don't really do stuff like that anymore. But um, and um, that's basically it. Uh, this is yeah, I think there's a lot less rules than there were last year. It was like eight. Oh, and keep the video under ten minutes. Uh, I'm looking at you, Robbie. No, I'm kidding. Um. So yeah, please keep the video under ten minutes, and um, but no really, no really, no other rules besides that. Just read the rules in the description um, again, because I'm not gonna read them. So I can't remember half of them. I'm probably gonna have to go look at the video again and <laughs> write down the rules from there. So with that said, guys, comment, like, subscribe, and the deadline for the contest is going to be. Um, I'm going to give you till June 20th. That that gives you 8 days. Okay? No way, maybe that's not fair. 22nd, that gives you 10 days. June 22nd. So, I guess what I did last time. So comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.